Are you one of those people who don't know the difference between a primer, sealer and an undercoat? Well, so was I and it's quite important because knowing the difference could save you a lot of money and extra work in the long run. All right, so what are the main differences between a primer, a sealer and an undercoat? It's a question that pops up from time to time and it can be a bit confusing. So let's try and deconfuse the whole situation once and for all so you can make an informed choice the next time you need to. A prep coat is actually the term used to describe all preparation coats. So primers, sealers and undercoats are all technically prep coats. And a prep coat is any coat of paint applied to your surface that prepares it for the application of the top coat. It's often overlooked, but when painting new surfaces, the prep coat is actually the most important step of a painting project. The word primer comes from the Latin word prim, which means first. A primer then is the first coat that should be applied directly to a bare surface, providing excellent adhesion, forming a firm foundation for the top coats. Think of it as an anchor that the rest of the layers of paint can hook onto. A sealer is very similar to a primer, but is specifically made to make porous surfaces non-porous, while providing good adhesion between the surface and the new paint. Traditionally, the key role of a sealer has been to bind gypsum plaster before the top coats were applied. Another important feature of a sealer is that it can act as a barrier between incompatible finishing coats, like painting latex over glossy oil base paints. An undercoat is used after the primer and the sealer. It's used to fill any minor imperfections to create a smooth, even coloured surface ready for the application of the top coats. An undercoat also assists to lighten a surface when changing from a dark to a light colour or vice versa. A general rule of thumb is that if you're painting a new surface, always use a primer. But if you're painting over an existing surface that has been painted in the past, an undercoat will do well. Or today, you can buy one of these bad boys. A three-in-one prep coat that saves you time, money and confusion. Burger Premium Triple Prep or Dulux One Step Acrylic Primer Sealer and Undercoat are a couple of good options. If you found this video helpful, you might be interested in this next one where we'll give you some helpful hints to avoid your paint peeling off.